This Christmas, John, official trailer, The Boys in the Boat. The title says it all. <laughs> boys in the Boat. That's what they're doing. The Husky Clipper. Yeah. Um, it's official trailer, John. Two and a half minutes long. It's coming out at Christmas. Don't know I too much about this. It's coming out at Christmas this year. Yeah, I think it's. I think it's the strike <laughs> thing. It's uh, they're yeah. all. Uh, what do you call that? Everything's bottlenecking. Yeah, <laughs> like get it out before out. the end yeah. of the year. Fucking out, out, yeah. out, so, out. I don't know too much about this song. To be honest with you, what I'm thinking right off the top of my head, I'm seeing two canoes. Yeah, is that what you? It looks like a period piece as well, judging by the. Could it be Attire. Oxford and Cambridge, the race? Yeah. That's what like I'm a, thinking. I yeah. can't think of any other race, famous race involves. Yeah. Rowan. At least river. the English don't call it a World Series or something no, like that. No. Yeah. <laughs> That's very much an American thing, isn't it? Yeah. World champions and all. It's uh, New England Patriots via the Kansas City Chiefs. Yeah. They're both from America. <laughs> they would win it anyway because it's their sport but yeah. fuck's sake baseball world series really <laughs> no other team outside of North America is playing in it how the fuck is that the world the world does not begin and end in America I know some people think it does it doesn't there's a huge expansive world outside of it I digress to you off in tangents here <laughs> I don't want to come across as being an American here, here. I love America uh, it's a great country <laughs> Um, it's a fan of all my, I'm a, some of my favourite people ever have came from. <laughs> Shall we please explain you know, this? Please, <laughs> please do. <laughs> the race. No, this is not, this is not. This is not uh, Starts now. There are some moments in life you never forget. Oh, well, right. So it's the... The depression hit everyone hard. No jobs, no food. We were broke. Looks like you still owe a balance on the semester. Yeah, yeah, Olympics. So what was that? I can't remember. You're the wrong team. You're on it. You get a part-time job included. You place to live. Eight-man crew is the most difficult team sport in the world. That gun's amazing. The average human body is just not meant for such things. Most of you will not be chosen. Beautiful speech, coach. They're announcing the team today. Are you gonna make it? We rode out of need. You better believe oh, I'm fucking making it, boss. Stay in school. Girl. We need to eat, to sleep. We gotta keep these right. Uh, as we okay. stay on the team. This champ, this day, this champ here with the blonde hair. He looks like a very young Richard Gere. Yeah, he does. The richest school in the nation. I've not seen Richard the Fruit Gear. I got nine seconds under the course record. Olympic year this year. Olympic year. I didn't realize. Yeah. Bunch of kids that's like no one else that's ever come through here. Everybody else tires and it just gets stronger. We have a boat that I believe could qualify for an Olympic spot. Hope you know what you're doing. They said we couldn't beat the Germans. We gotta beat those other schools first, but coach says we have a shot. Maybe we can roll as a team. If you guys don't get yourselves figured out, you're not racing at all. The boys, that boat, that's all I got. But they didn't understand who we were. The show was in this book. I don't believe what I'm seeing. Best boats. They're connected. Sweat and pain. What is worth, I'm proud of you boys. Inspiring. Uh, you missed the part where I told him not to tip over. And I won't. for your country. Roll for each other. For all the people who never believed in you. As one. As one. Josh Clooney. Well, he's very good, yeah. Stephen. Um, this is just a sort of genre within itself, the sort of sports genre, the rags to riches. Sort of tale of, I don't know, growth mm. and of becoming one. We've seen it with the likes of Cool Runnings. Spoke about that recently, I think. Yeah. Try to think off the top of my head, other sports movies. There's been a, a fair amount. But you've got this rags to riches yeah. concept. I'm not saying that we're at rags at any point, but Underdogs, we've obviously yeah. had to yeah. bond and become a unit and go through sort of personal struggles. And then the climax is going to be going to the Olympics and winning. But the yeah. looks of it, Alexander Desplat, Stephen, what a fucking composer. I'm yeah. sure he did The Deathly Hallows, Harry Potter. Mm. He's a fantastic composer. Yeah. 
So you've just got George Clooney. We were speaking about George. He's not yeah. a phenomenal director by any means. Well, John Suburbicon kind of sticks out to me, and I, I didn't like that film. It, it had great potential, and it wasn't his directing. I just think it just wasn't a good piece of storytelling, to be honest with you. Um, but this trailer, I'll, I've got one sort of bugbear with it. I hate when they do a period piece and they put modern music over the top of it. I and I Tom love, Petty, I love Tom Petty. I love that song, but it just takes me out. Personally, it just takes me out of the whole try to believe it's set in that time period of the late 1930s by it looks of it. It looks like it is the 30 Olympics, John. You're absolutely yeah, right. Was it 30? Uh, even though I'm not sure. I'm sure I it was, I'm, yeah. I think it was. It was pretty close to World War Two because they were trying to show the world we're civilised mm. and uh, no, they weren't. No, they certainly were not. I'm going to do my best. 1936. 36, was it? Jesse Owens, damn, yeah. Damn yeah, you. But we're close, yeah. We're close, but no cigar, sadly. Yeah, Jesse Owens is also the one that stands out. Yeah. Hitler was, raging. Yeah, he was a little fucking prick. Get it up him. Uh, <laughs> I'd have ripped his fucking moustache off after I won it as well. So yeah, it's, it's Stephen seen that stadium, though also the Olympia Stadium in, in Berlin. That was a fucking epic moment, to be fair, because you immediately, it's an immediately recognisable venue mm. uh, for all the wrong reasons and all the right reasons, because um, it really did show that you can stand up to these guys. Obviously, it was pre the war, but they knew what they were. The yeah. world knew what they were. They were putting on this false civility and you had guys like Owens going in and just standing up and saying, fuck you. And you've got obviously get that iconic shot of him. Yeah. And this is a story I didn't know about, I'm not going to lie. The no. actual canoeing, if that's what you call it, the rowing sort of side of things. Yeah, in the, it the says it, John, based on the best-selling book about the inspirational true story of the 1936 University of Washington rowing team that competed for the gold at the Summer Olympics in Berlin. And, and the beauty is, Stephen, I don't know if they won. You're presuming no. they do win. Yeah. But we've seen that with cool runnings, that sometimes yeah. you don't actually win, but it's the journey. Yeah, it's not about the, the end of win, yeah. ability. Yeah. Never say it's die sort growth. of attitude. Yeah. The growth of these individuals. Yeah. Joe Egerton, John's leading this, obviously. Oh, he's phenomenal. I don't know who Callum Turner is. I don't know who he is, but he's Callum obviously your, your man that was featured the most out with Joe Egerton in the Yeah, the Bond the trailer. boy. <clears throat> that we say yeah. it's kind of looked like... Richard, Richard Gere. Gere it does yeah. look a bit like Richard Gere 33 fucking yeah. hours a year younger than me nearly um, the day but it does it looks good it looks good um, yeah. certainly one to keep your eyes out for this December um, I like a sports film I like yeah, it's something about better, it. It? Yeah, it doesn't matter what the sport is uh, we were actually contemplating watching that cricket one John yeah. 1983 was it um, yeah the Indian one as yeah. well and I, I don't like cricket but it's something about sports oh, films I mean the other ones like. um, the rugby one with Mandela and Matt Damon, mm. but the South African mm -hmm. rugby team winning the World Cup. That's another one that stands out. Oh, yeah. When it's done right, it's just fucking great. There's Eddie the Eagle. There. Eddie the Eagle. I'm just, I'm just looking at your man that played Escaped him there. Escape to victory. <coughs> Taron Egerton. Um, Escape to victory. Escape to victory. Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. It's, it's, weird. it's a weird film. Michael Caine is a captain of this team and he doesn't film. even get a touch of the ball. Yeah, it's not it's, a sports film. It's like John Terry. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Didi Deschamps, yeah, no, Didi Deschamps, he did, he did, he get touches of the ball, you, Stephen hates Didi Deschamps, but Stephen's gone and he said that he was fucking rubbish and get carried, yeah. but I don't think he was, I think Hanging on the coattails as Zinedine Zidane, yeah, Terry Henry. I think everybody was hanging on the coattails as Zinedine, Zinedine was a fucking god, oh god, I watched Roy Keane talking about him, yeah. a freak of nature, six foot two and so talented, it's terrifying, a joke, my, one of my all time favourite players incidentally, but that's another story, yeah. What's your thoughts on the boys in the boat? The official trailer, the story. Do you know more about these lads from away back in 1936? Uh, from America, funnily enough, I was slagging off America. At the the start. lads. The lads, these lads. I'm just thinking that little English guy was drunk on yeah. YouTube. <laughs> lads, <laughs> lads, lads, yes. lads, lads. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> little ginger haired guy, was it? Yeah. A blonde haired guy. Cross between Alan Partridge and Boris Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was definitely an eating. Fucking lager, college. lager, lager. Absolutely. Fucking <laughs> 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 chip. He was a little fucking building boy, wasn't he? Eating, eating he, was, college. he was let out for the weekend. Absolutely. He's a private educated little <laughs> fucking... Lads, work. lads, lads. What peeve a word? I don't know. I've said it now. He's a little shit. But it was funny. It was actually a good video. What is your thoughts on it? Though? Comment down below about the film, about the trailer, about our reaction. Anything you feel compelled to share can be put down below in the comment section. Like the video if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon to get notifications. Straight to one's eyes. 
And what's left to be said is until next time, me and Stephen done. Thank you for watching and bye bye. <laughs>